A Point Pleasant man is facing a first degree murder charge after police say he stabbed his father on Saturday morning. Point Pleasant police say the suspect, Charles Neal Jr., stabbed his father, Charles Neal Sr., during a fight. Charles Sr. then died from his injuries on Sunday. News Channel 3's Kimberly Donahue spoke with one of his friends who says there won't be another person like him. An argument turning deadly. Point Pleasant police say they were called to this apartment on Lincoln Avenue Saturday morning on reports of a stabbing. Chief Joe Veith says an officer arrived to the scene and found 61-year-old Charles Neal Sr. covered in blood. According to a criminal complaint filed in Mason County Magistrate Court, Charles Sr. told the officer his son, Charles Neal Jr., stabbed him with a kitchen steak knife during a physical fight. Court documents say Charles Jr. was arrested after the incident on several factors, including, quote, the excited utterance of defendant that he stabbed Charles Lee Neal Sr. with a knife. Chief Beath says Charles Sr. was initially transported to Rivers Health in Point Pleasant before being flown to a hospital in Huntington. Veith says Charles Charles Sr. died from his injury Sunday morning. Jeremy Turner says he had just spoken to Charles Sr. on Thanksgiving. He called, what, ha, tell me happy Thanksgiving. I mean, he always give people good advice, try to get them to do better. Jeremy says Charles Sr. was always checking up on the people he cared about, and it's hard to imagine life without him. He's an old-fashioned guy, good friend. If you stopped by the scene, he always made sure you had something to eat, cigarettes, something to drink. I mean, if he's your friend, he's your friend. I mean, he definitely didn't deserve to go like that. I mean, that's my stuff. Kimberly Donahue, WSAZ News Channel 3, Mason County. Now, Charles Neal Jr. is being held without bond in the Western Regional Jail. He's going to appear in court within the next 10 days.